everyone. Good morning and welcome to the channel. I'm your host, Cloudy in the 16th. Um, thank you everyone for joining and for those who will be coming in. So today we're doing something a little different. If you guys haven't noticed, we're going to be doing Hearthstone. Uh, now, for those of you who probably don't know about Hearthstone, it is a card game that is, it turns down just a little bit, uh, it's a card game that's based on WoW, so World of Warcraft. Um, it's kind of like a turn-based, uh, well I wouldn't say completely turn-based, but like you have a turn, you play your cards, um, there's a time limit for your turn, so once it gets low, you'll see like a rope, and when the rope ends, your turn ends. Um, so basically you play uh, cards based on uh, mana. So every turn you uh, get a extra mana. So you start with zero. Uh, then your next turn you get one. Um, then it goes to your opponent. Your opponent gets one. Comes back to you. You get two. And so on and so forth. Until you get to ten. Uh, and each card you play costs a certain amount of mana. So if you have a one drop card, you can drop that on turn one. Um, or when you have one mana crystal. You can also play it whenever you have, you know, ten or le you know, or less. It's just you have to have that requirement for that particular uh, card. Um, so the game itself is based on uh, monsters. Um, they have what you would call secrets, which are basically kind of like traps. Uh, they also have like spell cards, which you know play your actions and things like that. Uh, and you know special effects for the creatures. Uh, terrains that change what the uh, like what you can play uh, if you play certain like side quest cards as well um, that you know have requirements to you know have their effect go off so there's a lot of little uh, effects and things like that that kind of go with playing this game so I've played it since pretty much beta um, before it was actually like an official game um, I had a beta key way back when the game first started. So I've been playing it for quite a bit. Um, I play it on and off. I don't play it as much as I did before. Uh, so I don't even, I think my deck currently for uh, standard play is not legal. So I'd probably have to make a new deck because I haven't played in about three months. Um, so there's a, probably a whole, there's a whole new uh, format. It's very much like any TCG game where you can play uh, where the meta changes so after a few you know months then there's new there's a new set that releases and what they do is they take whatever the oldest set that's in your block let's say they go with like 10 or let's say they do five sets then that fifth set once the sixth set comes in that fifth set falls off and then it goes into a format called wild which basically means you play everything um, I don't personally play wild I only play standard um, when I build decks um, so, you know, that's the gist of that. So, one sec, let me set something up really quick here. charge my put my phone on the charger and all that good stuff so that way uh, that can go so yeah so today we're gonna play a little quick stream not nothing too crazy today uh, we're gonna basically do her stuff so forgive me like I said it's been a while since I've played it looks like the um, so I'm gonna start with a tavern ball yeah I'm, or excuse me I'm gonna start with a Arena, let me reconnect to the internet. So my internet's being stupid. Oh, uh, yeah. So they have two modes now. They have battlegrounds, which, as you can see, um, basically eight people go in. You know, seven people include myself. 
would go into this battleground. It's kind of like a king of the ring, king of the hill kind of thing. Uh, and then you build your deck as you play, basically. So, like, you start off with, like, five cards or whatever, and then you, you know, uh, or you start off with no cards, I should say. And then you basically build your field versus building a deck. Um, but in Arena, you literally, it's basically what it says here. You draft 30-card deck, and you play with that against other people. So we're going to do that. I think I have a free one. Um, yes. So we're going to actually do Arena today. Uh, we'll do Arena, and then we'll try the Tavern Brawl. Uh, nothing crazy today. Like I said, I'm not gonna, it's not going to be a super long stream. Hey, Jen. How are you doing? Welcome to the stream. So, yeah, just playing some Hearthstone. It's not going to be a crazy long stream today. Just, uh... Trying out some new stuff that I got for this game. So, Jin Jin, welcome, welcome. And how are you doing today? Thanks for joining. I might go with, I'm not sure which one I'm going to go with. I think I might do. See, Priest is all about like healing and like taking control of other people's creatures. Uh, so, it's very much a like stall kind of control deck. Uh, where Warlock is, you do a lot of damage to yourself, you play a bunch of small creatures, uh, and you kind of like swarm the field, but you do a lot of like self damage and like multi damage to like both players, so you, your health is really at risk when you play as a Warlock. Um, Warrior, uh, a lot of charge, which is basically uh, being able to attack on the first turn that they drop, because most creatures have a... Um, I guess you could call it like a summoning sickness, I guess you could say. When they first come into play, they can't attack. They have to wait one turn. Um, unless they have the ability Rush or Charge. Uh, rush allows them to attack a creature on the field as soon as it comes out. And uh, Charge allows them to attack as soon as they come out. So they can attack the, a creature on the field or they can attack the opponent directly. Uh, so they can do either or. Uh, give me one quick sec. I'm still kind of adulting today with my daughter. I want to make sure that she's okay real quick. Uh, one sec, guys. Sunshine. Sorry about that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. All right. So, yeah. So, let's get started. Um, I'm going to probably go with uh, Warrior. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with Warrior just because it's it's pretty easy to use. Oh, it's Halloween. Oh, so I should probably explain that. So, during Halloween, they do, like, Halloween costumes and stuff like that for the characters. So, you can pick two classes when you're playing an arena. So I'm gonna be either Warrior Paladin, Warrior Warlock, or Warrior Druid. Uh, let me explain, uh, I've already talked about uh, Warlock. Let me explain Paladin and Druid a little bit. So Paladin, uh, oh, I should also explain what these are. So each hero has a hero power that costs two mana to use it. Dr uh, Warlock's hero, hero power is to do two damage to yourself to draw a card. That's what this is. Uh, Druids is to gain one armor and gain one attack. The armor stays with you until you get damaged. So it's basically like gain extra HP above your maximum HP cap. Because it's an armor uh, HP that sits on top of your health. So if you have 30 health and you get one armor, now you have basically 31 HP. Because they have to hit that one armor first before they damage your uh, HP. So, uh, Druid gives you one armor and also gives you one attack, so that way the player itself can attack with one damage. Uh, where Paladin plays a 1-1 uh, Squire, or I should say, uh, like, you know, Squire token or Knight token, um, which is basically a 1-1 creature. 
So that's uh, its ability. Warrior gets two armor for his uh, hero power. It just gains two armor. That's what it gets. Uh, so if I went warrior for character, what it's going to do is going to give me a lot of warrior cards in my deck. But the hero power is going to be one of these three. So because of that, I'm going to take druid because I want the armor. So, if that makes any sense to people that um, have never played this game, I'm going to be explaining, you know, a lot because I'm sure there's people out there that's never played or, you know, they've never even seen this game or even heard of this game. Uh, so, so to kind of explain what's going on now, now I need to build a 30-card deck. So, what's going to happen is they're going to give me three cards to choose from every uh, turn, I guess you could say, until I have 30 cards built up in my arena deck. So I have to pick one of these three, and I have to do that every time I pick one. So you get a choice of three. Now you can kind of, if you know how the decks work, or if you know how uh, you know the game itself works, then you kind of know what type of deck you want to build when you have a certain type of character and uh, and hero power. So I want because this is a warrior druid deck, druid deals with a lot of like nature so they'll have a lot of beasts they'll have a lot of like tree creatures uh, things like that and they have a lot of like healing cards um, and then like adding a lot of creatures to the field so that's what the druid is the druid is you know the nature so it deals with that type of thing where warrior has a lot of creatures that just come out and attack um, and do things so I'll explain which card I think is the best and that's the one I'm going to pick What's up, goddess? Thanks for stopping into the stream. Just playing a little Hearthstone real quick. Probably won't be that long today. Probably about an hour or so. Um, just doing some arena and kind of going over some stuff. So, Battle Cry, if you guys see that here, that effect happens when you play the card. So, when I play that card, this effect activates. Oh, uh, Stealth basically covers the card to where it cannot be attacked for one turn so it basically doesn't exist on the field for one turn it you know it's hiding basically it's concealing itself so that's what stealth is um uh, i add one spell card one new cost spell card to for your class to your hand this is actually pretty good sup Psy? hey danny welcome to the stream welcome to the stream just doing a little bit of a herbstone, uh, explaining some stuff, and I'm doing like an arena. It probably won't be again too long today. Uh, so I prefer see battle cry used when you hero power. Okay, that card's not that great, but it does have two three. So this is their attack, and this is their health. So how does it work? Creatures attack each other. So let's say this card was attacking this card. So he would do his six damage to the three health, which would kill it. His two damage would do would do to his health, which would leave him at four. So he would die, and then he would be now a six four, if that makes sense. So that's how the damage works. If there's no creatures on the field, then you attack uh, directly. I just randomly picked a card, but it's fine. That one's not that bad. So, um, so as I said, battle cry. When you play the card, it's a five crystal card, so it means I would need five crystals. This one gives you an extra crystal. It's actually a really good card, but I don't. Yeah, Hearthstone. It's the game. Yes, this is the game I was talking about, uh, Danny. Oh, uh, yeah, it's like a card uh, game kind of thing. So this one's actually really good. Battle Cry gives other minions Death Rattle. So death rattle means when they die, effect happens. So basically when this card, when I play this card, I can give another card on the field, death rattle, summon 1-1 one, one demon. So when it dies, a 1-1 one, one demon would come out. So I'm going to take that one. It's a good card. Uh, next card, so spell burst. Spell burst is a new thing. Deals two damage. To so spell burst is basically when you play... Oh, uh, it actually says right there, one time effect after you cast a spell. So basically, I'll play a spell, then spell burst will go off. So that's basically how that works. Um, I already explained Battle Cry. 
Uh, spell damage basically gives a uh, one second. So yeah, that basically gives, uh, excuse me, that gives damage to the card. So let's say I have a spell that says it does two damage. If I have spell damage on a card, now it does three damage. So it adds damage to a spell, if that makes any sense. Death Rattle I explained, basically when he dies, when this card dies, you get a three, four Sea Serpent. So it has zero attack, which means it will just sit there until someone attacks it, or I do enough damage to kill it to get this card. So it's okay. I'm probably not gonna pick it. I'm probably gonna do this one only because it's a big creature. I'm not really using it for the effect. I just need a big creature to add to my deck, basically. So that's why I'm picking it. Um, most people probably would've picked something else. All right, so Taunt. Probably one of my favorite uh, effects. As you can see there, enemies must attack this minion. So basically, it's like he puts up a shield when he drops down, and whenever you, whenever anyone has to attack, they have to attack this first. So if I have another creature out that has like a cool effect or whatever, they have to attack this first. So um, Death Rattle, uh, not that great. And whenever this minion takes damage, you gain that much armor. This is actually good because if some, let's say I attacked with like like that six six, and I attacked him, I gain six armor because of how much damage he took to his health. Um, so this is automatically a guaranteed basically two armor when he's out there, because when he dies, I'm gonna get at least two. Um, so this is kinda like, here's a free two armor, two two creature. Pretty good. Or here's a three drop taunt that when he's at full health, meaning as soon as I put him out, he'll actually be a three six. And then he takes damage, he'll go back down to a one six. So this is actually really good. So I'm gonna actually take that, if that makes any sense. Um, this doesn't have an effect, as you can see. That means it's basically a vanilla. So it just has two and seven attack, but it's gold, meaning that it's a higher rarity. And as you can see, it's pitcher moves when they're gold. It just means it's, you can get any card gold. Uh, this means that this is the higher rarity, um, of this card, um, which is a gold rare, basically. Um, which is really cool to have, because you like to have gold stuff, but it's not useful for me. This card is actually very tech. So it says choose one. So it has two different effects. When you play this card, you pick one of them. Either give a minion plus one plus one. So, you know, make this a three eight or make this an eight eight. Uh, or I summon a three two panther. So it's either a creature or give everything a plus one. Really good. I'm gonna take that. Uh, so you guys know what Battle Cry is. This is actually really good. Deal four damage to two different minions, and it's a four ten. Uh, it's a dragon, which you know any cards that work on dragons will work on this. The only issue is this is an eight drop, so I can only play this late game. But late game, I'm be able to kill basically two monsters that have, to have low uh, health. This one, another taunt. Uh, if it's the only card by, by itself out there, it gets plus two. So it'll be a four six at four drop. Uh, eh. And this one, when you summon it, you get three one one Huntress for your opponent's side. So you're basically giving your opponent three creatures by getting this. The reason why it, it does that is because for this cost, to be able to have three seven is insane for a three drop. So it has to have a weakness, and the weakness is giving your opponent three small creatures. Um, I'm not going to pick that. I'm going to take the dragon, uh, because I also want like another late game card to deal with. Uh, this is basically a removal card. If anyone knows what removal is, it basically gets rid of a creature. Uh, you can either deal three damage to one minion, or you can do one damage to pretty much anything, and then draw a card. So it's like deal one damage, draw, or deal three damage to that card. Really good, and it's gold. This one summons a random seven cost minion. That is really good. Yes, it's eight drop and it's an eight eight, which is basically the, the curve for an eight drop. Uh, but the fact that when it dies, it gets you basically another creature that's gonna be slightly weaker or maybe even about the same in power because there are some seven drops that are eight in damage is pretty good. So I'm gonna take that. 
Usually I would have took Wrath, but that's really good just to have some backup. Now I kind of need to, when you're building a deck also, um, I should probably explain that. Oh, uh, you kind of want to have some balance. So the balance is where you see down here at the bottom where it has zero, one, two, three, all the way up to seven plus. The balance, they're trying to basically see how your mana curve is for the deck. So what are you going to be playing a lot of? I like to have a lot of lower drop creatures and then very few big drop creatures so that way I can actually play them. So now I'll be focusing on how much they cost and not so much what their effect is, if that makes sense. So like, for instance, this is a three drop. When I play it, I get a four cost card to my hand. So this basically gives me another card for free. Um, this one deals three damage to itself. So basically it's a two drop for two, three and not two, six. Because it deals damage to itself. But it has the potential to go back up to that because if you have healing cards, you can heal it. Hence, injured Tarvar. And this one, when it dies, you get a one drop being into your hand. But because it's a one drop, I'm going to take that. Because literally I can play that my first turn. And if it dies, I get another card. So, kind of good. Uh, don't want that because I don't, I don't really do spell damage per se. So that's kind of a waste. And I already have one. Um, and I'm using it just for its effect. You can have two of any uh, card, just so you know. So you can basically have two of any of these, and you can't have more than two of any card. Unless you're playing an arena, and it keeps coming up, then you can have a lot more than the one. Whenever a hero attacks, gain five armor. Now this is going to be really, really good. I'm explaining why. My hero power that I'm getting is attack, get one plus attack, plus turn, or per turn. So if I use my hero power and attack while this is on the field, I gain five armor. Kind of good. So taking that. If I didn't have this attack, then I wouldn't have took that creature, if that makes sense. Because I wouldn't be able to attack on my own. Um, I would have to wait to have a weapon. There are weapon cards in this game. So I would have to literally wait until I had a weapon and attack. Um, but because I have that effect, I can attack pretty much whenever I want. So that's really good. Uh, so you guys know what Death Rattle is. I already have one of these, as you can see. Pretty good. I might take two. Um, this gives a dragon plus two in my hand. But I don't even really have... Well, I actually have three dragons already. So I actually have a pretty good dragon hand. This is what I'm going to take because of Lifesteal. Lifesteal, when this attacks and does damage, you gain life equal to its attack. So this is just giving me health. So I'm going to take that. Now, uh, I also probably should explain a little bit about the colors. So you see the little white dot next to their underneath their name um, for most of these cards. Uh, that means they're common. In uh, that means they're basically common. This this means that they're this orange means that they're legendary. So these are legendary um, or uh, yeah, legendaries. Which means they have really cool effects. And you can also tell by the, their border having this little wing. Uh, meaning that they're legendary cards. So this is going to be a really good card. You just don't usually get many of these. So you might get maybe two in a deck. So I got to be careful. This one gives beasts, creatures. I don't really use a lot of beasts. So that's pretty useless to me. This one reorders the deck from the highest cost to the lowest cost. So basically I'll play this and now all my high stuff will start showing up versus my low stuff. Don't, that's real like tech play. That's if you know you need a card late game that's like a high cost and you need it to show up. So this is a card you would hold on to. You wouldn't necessarily play this. This is kind of like a tech card. But I'm going to take, I kind of want to take this tech card but... I kind of also want to play a game that is like easy to like show you guys, so I'm gonna take this one. Um, Divine Shield basically puts a shield on it, means you have to attack it once or do damage to it once before it takes any damage. And then Rebirth means it comes back after it dies with one HP. So it'll die and it'll come back as a 10 1. So it is a 10 drop, which means I'll probably never play it, but it can be very useful late game. Alright, so Reborn. This is actually pretty good. It means when it comes back, um, or when it gets damaged, it'll have a three. So he'll be a three if he takes one, like three, one. 
Um, so people don't really want to attack this, or if they do, they want to kill it quickly. Uh, and this one, Twin Spell. So Twin Spell means you can play this card twice. You can play it once, and as long as you have enough mana to play it again, you can play it again. Um, and then you choose one of the two effects. Either draw a card or summon a 3-2 Eagle. This is really good. I'm going to take that. It's a low cost, and I want it. Uh, I'm not even going to explain this, because you guys know what taunt is already. So add two taunts to my hand. This one's actually pretty good. It's a taunt, and when it dies, it gets you another taunt. Um, it gets you two 1-1 one, one, uh, scribes with taunt to your hand. It's actually really good, but the fact that this showed up is even better. Destroy a damaged mini a minion. Oh. Uh, you literally, I can literally attack with my hero power, do one damage to the enemy, and then play this. So let's say it's, you know, like the 1010, for instance, um, and I don't have enough damage out in the field to be able to kill this. I would simply use my hero power, hit it. Yeah, it might take 10 damage because I'm going to take that 10 damage anyway, because he's going to attack me next turn, and I don't have anything to stop it, and then I can play this, and that kills it. So, card's amazing, basically. Uh, this draws a card early game, really good. This allows you to attack when he... As soon as you play this card, he can attack a monster. That's what Rush means. Um, it's okay. It's a little high. I've got a bunch of high-cost creatures right now. I need to get low. Um, this gives a taunt minion plus two plus two. Very situational. Not going to use that. So, we're going to use this for draw the card. Ah, here we go. Weapon. So this is a weapon that I was talking about. Basically, you play this, it equips to the side of him. It'll be like off to the side. And then he has three damage for two attacks. That's how weapons work. And then they break and they're gone. Um, this deals one damage to a minion. If it survives, you add a lackey card to your hand. Now, a lackey is an archetype of a bunch of like 1-1 one, one small creatures. But they always summon something else or get you some other effect. Uh, you summon one, it could give you a spell card. You summon one, it could summon another monster. You summon one, it can gain taunt and plus three. So there's a bunch of different effects that the lackeys do. So this is actually a pretty good card uh, if you want to be able to do some damage and get some da uh, get a card back. Battle Cry, you summon this card, uh, it deals one damage to a minion, and it gives it a uh, divine shield. If you have a really beefy creature, like let's say him, and he already lost his divine shield, I'd play this, do a damage to him, just to give it to Divine Shield so that it would live. So, kind of situational. Or you just do the damage to a creature and kill it. So, these basically do the same thing in a way. Uh, but this is a creature with 2-1. And this gets you a creature to your hand. That could potentially gets you another creature to your hand. So, this is kind of like a plus 2. Where this is just like kill a creature and then have a creature. So, I'm going to take this because I'm also low on spells. Uh, Starfire, basically do 5 damage, draw a card, uh, play him, draw a card, or gain damage equal, or gain attack equal to a weapon that you have. So this card's really good if I have weapons, but I'm not planning on using weapons, so I'm not worried about him. I will take this, just because it gets me the draw, and it's a decent, beefy creature. Battle Cry, when there's damage to the minion, uh, gain plus 1. Eh, that's actually not bad. There is a damaged minion, it gains plus one and re rust. So I could play that and basically attack something and kill it pretty quickly. Um, or summon this, and I give my opponent three small creatures. Uh, because it's so beefy at four, that's why. Or I play this, and it just keeps gaining one health every turn. Or, excuse me, one health every turn, which is actually pretty good. So we'll do that. Uh, let's see. So, what it means by upgrades each turn, gain one armor. So, every turn I have this in my hand, this number goes up. So, if I have it in my hand for one turn, then this goes gain two armor. Another turn, gain three armor. Another turn, gain four armor. So, that's how upgrade each turn works. So, if I just hold this, I can uh, potentially gain a ton of armor late game. Um, so, that's kind of what that does. Uh, this is just drop the card down. He can't be hit the first turn, so he'll... Basically, he won't, he'll stay in stealth until you attack. So he's just like a, a hidden creature on the field for a while. Unless someone does a global attack, which hits everything on the board, including stealth and things like that. Uh, spell Burst, again, not really using as much. Um, 
but I'll probably will use this guy because it will save me in the end. Uh, summon, it dies, it gets another creature, destroy another person's weapon, which is actually really good, so I'm going to actually take that. And this is a tech card. Uh, weapons can be very dangerous in this game, so you, you want to be able to destroy them. So that is a card I'm going to hold, basically. I already have one of those. Here's a weapon that has spell bursts. Summon a student of a taunt. Um, equal to the um, stats are equal to the spell's cost. So if I play a spell, I summon a creature that has taunt, and then I gain the stats are gained by the cost of the spell. Like for instance, if I play this, it will just be a one because the spell costs one basically. Um, this is the vanilla beat stick. You know, six seven for six. And this is one of the dragons that we have already. I'll just take another one. So we have two of them. This gives taunts to two creatures next to it. That's with adjacent. So if I put this in between two creatures, the two creatures next to it will have taunt. Uh, pretty good if you want to like protect yourself. Um, this, now silence is really, really good in this game. So silence basically takes a power away from a creature. So I play this, it makes the creature basically vanilla. So if it had an effect, like let's say taunt here, it no longer has taunt. Now I can attack it. Now I can attack straight through to the opponent and not have to worry about that. If I use it on this, it no longer has reborn. So it, when it dies, it doesn't come back. You know, so silence can be same thing with this. If I use it on this, when it dies, I don't get that summon for the random seven cost minion, which would be devastating. Um, to lose that effect because that's the whole reason why you're playing the card um, other than it being an 8-8 eight, eight. so there's a lot of things that you could play silence on that would literally break the game and you know you would be in a very winning condition this card actually got nerfed it used to be a two drop they made it a three drop because of how powerful it was and it used to be i think two two instead of two one so we'll take that obviously really good silence card uh, gain armor, draw a card, or um, get two mana crystals, or draw three cards. I'm going to be taking that one. I'm going to go a little quicker now that I've kind of explained things a little bit. Spell damage, plus one. Battle cry, discover a spell. It's actually really good. Um, this is also good. Do two damage to two random minion minions. This can really be a really good kind of like early board wipe for two creatures. I don't have enough wipe, so I'm going to take that. No. So dormant basically means it will sit there for two turns as a non-existent creature. It's like a little egg or a little shell kind of thing. And then after it comes out, then it's a 3-5 with rush. Um, so that's what dormant is. That's why it's a low cost because you're actually not going to get this. If I play this on turn two, I won't actually get the creature till turn four. So basically it's a four drop 3-5 technically. But you can play it early. Um, and this is give plus two to a man, da, 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 add a cub to your hand. I don't know what this is. I've never seen this card. Um, interesting. I'm going to take it just because I've, I haven't used it. And I don't know what it is. It's some new cards in this game that I haven't seen yet. So this sits out there, gives everybody plus one, plus one. Rush. And summon a minion from your deck. Give it taunt and divine shield. So... This could summon anything that's in my deck, and when it comes out, it'll be a taunt with divine. Eh. I don't like how high of a cost it is. Yes, it gets me a free monster from my deck and gives it taunt, but it's a really high cost. But out of all these cards, it's probably the better one to take. So, taking another execute without question. And then now we have a legendaries. It dies, I, I gain eight cards. Jesus. Um, this one, I play a card, it summons a 2-2 two -two creature. So every time I'm playing a card, it summons a creature. Pretty good. And this one is deadly. At the end of your turn, deal two damage to all other characters. That includes myself, the other hero, all creatures on the field except for this. So everything takes two damage at the end, including me. It's like one of those Warlock cards I was talking about, where it does damage to you and your opponent and everybody. 
Um, it's the choices out of these two. I don't have a lot of wipe, and I like to have field wipe. So I'm going to take this and use it tech. Use it for tech. Use it for smart plays, basically. Uh, poisonous. Now, poisonous means that if it does, if it damages anything, it dies automatically. No matter how strong it is, it dies. So you always want something poisonous. And this can't be targeted by hero powers or spells. This is amazing. It's weak, but it's amazing. So dormant, I drop him, and at turn three, I get an axe. Not terrible. Uh, this one gives me taunt, rush, battle cry gains plus four. So this is basically a five drop, five eight on the first turn, and it can kill something because it has rush, and it just sits there. Pretty good actually. Actually, all three of these are. Well, these two are what I would debate from. I'm looking at my curve, and my low cost is getting kind of low, so I need to get a little bit higher on costs. So I'm gonna take the five drop. This game, this is a game ender, so I'm taking this. Taunt, when it dies, it gets basically another one of these with taunt. Pretty good. So, I'll be taking that. And that is my deck. So, now we have our deck. So how arena works is you, bu you, battle, you battle people, and if you lose three times, you're out. If you make it to, I believe, 12 wins, then you win. So, let us begin. And let's show you guys how Hearthstone works. And sorry I took uh, 30 minutes to explain <laughs> how this game works and how, you know, explanations on each card effect and things like that. I like to be thorough when I do a new game and, you know, there's people here that's probably never played it or even heard of it, so... See our little Halloween costumes. They don't normally look like this. Alright, so, so this is how this game, game works. works. Now, now you, you can mulligan, mulligan first turn. Basically, basically means you can uh, get, get rid of any cards you don't, don't want to start, start with. So you just X them out like that. that. Um, and, and you, you also, also have a timer. timer to how long, long it takes for you to do this. this. And, and you see, he kind of got three new cards. I only got one card back. Now the coin... They, they always give it to the, the person, person who goes second, second so, so that, that way they, they can, can kind of catch, catch up to the, the mana cost. So you didn't have anything to play with one mana. Now, I have one mana, but I have this. So I can play this giving me two mana, meaning I can play this or this, which I will do. So I'll play that. Now I have two crystals. So it's a temporary thing. I could play this, add one card to my hand, or I could play this. I don't need life, so I'm actually going to play that, because I get it wrong. See, this, this is what happens when you take too long. You get the rope. You see it's sleeping. One of my friends came online. Yeah, so she, she attacked, killed it, she took two damage. I drew a card for him dying, and I drew a card for my turn. So, if that, that makes sense. Um, as a spell to hand, so I'm going to play that. Get a free card. So now that basically gives me a weapon or upgrade a weapon. And we have the same hero power. So, so she played something for a weapon. So, uh, I was going to kill him. Get him out of there, and we'll play. We'll play this, and we'll play our hero power. So now I have one armor and one damage. I'll attack her, and my turn. So yeah, this is pretty much how this game works. Now I can't target him because he's silent. Or because, because he's stealth. stealth. So, so otherwise, I would silence him. him but I can't. You can't, can't target, target them. They're hidden, basically. So I'm, I'm gonna, gonna put 
to the fear of God in his heart by throwing this poison out. So now he's looking at this going, oh crap. So he either won't attack with this because he's afraid of this, or he will just attack right into it so that I don't kill another card. But in the meantime, hit him with arrow power again, do one damage to him, have my creature attack him directly, boom, in my turn. One to six level life, and I am at 30 life with two armor. So I'm basically at 32. He just plays secrets. Secrets, I don't know what it is. It's hidden, as it says. But I've played this game enough to where I know most of the what the secrets are. So potentially it could be a mirror, which if I summon a creature, he could get the same the same copy. But I'm going to play this. Silence this. So no longer, no longer has that ability to gain crystals. It, now I know that his secret is not the one that copies m monsters. Because I just played a monster and it didn't copy it. So I'm going to play this. There we go. Okay, so that was the secret. I played a spell and he got a monster. Place the vanilla just because it's there. Um, so, so I can basically do three damage. Four damage. Just gonna attack him. And bad echo. Think of Let me. Hold on. It's, it's probably because I'm sitting in the living room and. There's no, like, uh, background. But I turned the mic down a little bit, see if that helps. Let me know if that helped a little bit, coffee. And thanks for jumping in, by the way. Thanks for being here. Alright, so I wasn't really paying attention, but he just killed literally all of my creatures I had on the field. So I can taunt and kill one of these creatures with him. Nope, nope, what goddess? Still echoes? Yeah, I think it's because I'm out, um, I'm pretty sure it's because I'm, uh, it's sitting in the living room, and there's no, there's nothing in the background to keep, like, the noise from canceling. Hold on, let me, let me do my turn, and I'll check it real quick. Alright, so yeah, I just wanted to summon a creature to have some creatures out here. I don't want to attack him because I don't want to take any damage. Alright, that'll be my turn. Is that any better? I'm just turning the mic down a little bit to see if that helps because the mic is really loud and it picks up a lot of um, area. Or when you have your fan on. No, it's because I, I think it's because my daughter's watching TV in the background. Cause I don't have my fan on. I'm just sitting in the living room. Just sitting in the living room, but the mic's like right by my face. So. I could turn the music up on the game. Maybe that'll help a little bit. Let me know if that fixes it. But yeah, he's like wrecking me right now. So I'm gonna play that because I want to kill one of his creatures. This one does, whenever he takes damage, whenever your hero takes damage on your turn, summon, oh, so if I attack him, he'll get a creature. So I want to kill that. I want that dead. That's why he's killing me. And then I'm going to summon a creature. Because we need we need the field protection. And he can kill all these guys except for him. So I'm gonna save my attack. Oh, it could be that. Or you're watching yourself at the same time as Echo. No, I'm not watching myself. Um I'm actually only on one monitor right now. I'm just oh 
I have Streamlabs going, and then Hearthstone is minimized, and it's just over the screen. So I'm actually just playing on one thing right now. I have to check and see how bad it is. I have to pull my phone up and see um, if it's like so bad that it's just like unwatchable, or is it just? Hopefully this kills these two. Oh, that, that works. There we go. There we go. I know, so lucky, right? And then I will just attack. Because these things freeze, I think. Yeah, see, they freeze you. So I want those to go away. Freezing just, it means you can't attack for that turn. It says, hmm. Then I don't know. It's not that bad. Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's because I'm in the living room, and there's no, like, when I'm in the room, I can shut the door and shut the other doors, and the, uh, the sound will kind of, like, you know, stay in one place. I'm in the living room, there's no doors, so it's just... <laughs> it says, I'm fine with it, because it just sounds like you're talking again after you already spoke. Oh, that does kind of suck, though. Alright, summon, summon the big guy. Summon this one. And that ends my turn. Yeah, I don't know how to fix that, honestly. Um, I'll turn the speakers off. And let just, and let the mic. And let the mic just pick up the sound. See if that works. I'll, have to, I'll fix my settings later. Uh, let me see. Alright. So yeah, let me know if that's any better. I turned off one of the channels. I turned off the speakers. And I turned down the mic. Yeah, that's much better. Sweet. Okay. <laughs> Alright. So that's... So I get a free pack for playing. And I get another free pack because I played arena mode. And I get another free pack because it's arena mode. I got three free packs. And that thing down there is a quest. You have like quests that you do, um, daily quests that you can do, as you can see here. And it gains stuff. So I would get two more. Play if I play ten more cards, I'll get that. If I play fifty cards, I'll get those. And if I play four games in trials, I'll get that. So, I already got a loss. It's, it's fine. fine. We'll continue. Is it now it sounds the same. I didn't turn anything back on. I turned the mic down. I turned the speakers off. And I turned the audio capture down a little bit too. Just look, just look at the clip that man Mike would call it. At least it doesn't sound as bad as the giant from the camera. It didn't actually sound that bad from what I, what I could um, tell. So I don't want any of these cards to start off with because they're all high cost, and I can't play any of them right now. I would be sitting here way too long. Frames too. I think it's because I'm sitting in the living room too. And I'm not like hardline like I usually am. I was like, I'm just gonna keep hitting you until you swing this guy. Until 
until you swing this guy. take five damage just to break his armor. So, I'm going to play that. I'm going to go ahead and use this. I have two of them, so get rid of, get rid of him. Attack him. I'll use this guy to break his armor. Unless he kills him. Whenever you attack, gain five armor. Yeah, that'll, that'll probably be my next card right, right there. Oh! Oh, that was good. Okay. So now, I need to play this. So I'm basically going to wait. Because I don't want to put him out there to die just yet. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to gain six armor. So seven armor total. And I'm going to go ahead and take this damage so that he doesn't have his defiant shield on him anymore. Yeah, it's not bad dropping. Drop range detected by 26%. I mean, it's not bad. Let me know how bad it is. I may have to just come, come back and do this one later. Alright, so yeah. Now, those two are going to die, and he'll be down to six. Now, I'm scared because my health is lower than his, so he might let this live. But then again, he doesn't want the all his cards getting killed. So he might just kill it right here. But this could be the trade there. It was, I mean, smart. I mean, I would. I'd trade. I'll, actually, I don't know. I might attack me directly because it will leave me at 8. And then I would be so scared that this card could kill me that I would trade. See what I'm saying? So, like, there's where the tactics come in. But he could also be afraid that I have a taunt. But I don't, so. Oh, okay. Oh, that's smart. Yep, I'm dead. Oh, no, I'm not dead. Look at that draw. Good draw. And now, we'll play him. And now I can start gaining some armor. Unless he kills it. Because every time I attack, yeah, you can see, every time I attack, he'll be gaining armor, bro. I'll be gaining five armor. Now, I can play this next turn. Oh, he played a big taunt. He says, and now somehow miraculously sounds ten times better if without an echo. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, I guarantee you it's probably me turning down the stats. And, um... So that probably was what did it. So... Crap. 
crap, crap, crap. I want to deploy this. But I also want to attack. Oh my god, this is going to be rough. Thank you. Okay, let's just do... Let's just do this, see what happens. Oh, nice. Oh, heck yeah. Oh, that's good. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's real good. All right. Oh, we wait. We just wait here. Because now he has to attack into my Divine Shield uh, Dragon. And if it dies, I get a 7 drop. Great play. Great play. Trying to save me. Man, he's back again. Wow. I don't know why. I, I didn't change the stats again. I literally just left everything the way it was. Yeah, maybe I'll, I'll turn the audio capture down a little bit more. Let's see if that helps. Oh, it's my frame rate? Yeah. I think it is, too. That's probably why it's doing that in my frame rate. Sorry, I had to switch to my phone. Oh, no, you're good. You're good, Coffee. Just dealing with the, the echoing of my mic when it's in the living room. It has to be in, like, a closed area or I have to have something. I probably have to put, like, a sound. Emerald, I'm in the middle of something, okay? Go sit down. Just go sit down. It's so quiet. Alright, you want me to turn it up, I guess? I can turn it back up. I just didn't want the echoing. Hold on, let me see. Alright. See if that's a, see if that's better. Alright, so yeah, they he literally tried to kill everything there. So I'm going to attack that. Yeah, see, look at that. Now let's gain some armor. He doesn't have a weapon. Let's draw a card. Okay. And I don't care about that card. He can sit there all he wants. And I'll just... Oh, uh, no, he has weapons, I think, so I'm not going to waste that. You're going to hate me, but I've never played. Oh, dude, there's so many people that have never played this. I do not hate you at all. That's actually one of the reasons why I decided to play it today, because, oh, uh, Sai, I don't think she's here, though. She left already. She was here earlier in, this, in the stream. But uh, I was talking to her about it and had realized how long it's been since I played it. I hadn't played it in about three four months and um so i was like you know what I'll, i could play hearthstone it's it's a game that you play for like a couple hours you know what i mean like you don't it's not you don't have to play that long so i could do like a quick stream with it and it's one of those games i usually played regularly like i'd wake up in the morning and it was like after i did all my hygiene stuff and then like eight i'd play this <laughs> so it was like my morning ritual for a while Oh my god. I haven't played this in a very long time. Yeah. Oh yeah, guys, you have you you do have this. Uh let's see. Alright, so I have a pretty good advantage here. I'm just gonna play that. And play that. And that's two, four, five, six, seven. So he could kill me. So I need to kill one of these. He could kill me with he could have killed me with damage, so I had to take out one of those creatures. So I'm only at 13. My two-year-old got my espresso shot cups. Dad. I can read everything except for the... Yeah, same. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Yeah, I don't... So, oh, she's running around grabbing stuff. Yeah, kids do that. I was freaking out. Oh, oh my god. I've Trust me, I've been there. Trust me, I've been there, Coffee. Like, I have a four-year-old, so when she was two... Before she was two, actually. When she was, like, one and a half, she was a handful. I mean, she's still a handful. 
but she would get into anything. Matter of fact, this morning she got into like ink. I don't know where she got into it, but she had like this little thing of ink and it was all over her face this morning. And I'm just like, what the heck? How do you have ink all over your face? Where'd you even get this ink? So, oh, wait, I need that. This could give me some life. This could give me some life. Um, he's just a big, dumb creature. I'm just going to play that. Play that, because get some armor. This could be a problem. It's going to make one of his cards really strong. But I really didn't have a choice. I really didn't have a choice. It was way too big. All right. Oh my goodness, yeah. Oh my god, wait. Until she's in her teens and after high school. I don't want to even think that far ahead, goddess. Like, I don't want to think that far ahead. Like, I want to take it one year at a time. <laughs> like, I don't want to think about, you know, you know, menstrual cycles and, you know, boyfriends and all that kind of stuff until I need to. <laughs> it's like, I do not want to think that far ahead. I'm all, I've already been looking at shotguns, like, so, just saying. <laughs> right? <laughs> Good process. Yes, that's, that's, that's how, I, that's the only way I'm going to have to deal with it, <laughs> is take it one step at a time. Because, I mean, I grew up with literally brothers, like, my, basically my four sisters now, they're all young. You know what I mean? Like, they were all, like, babies when I was, like, a teenager. So, yeah, she better yield. Go away. I'll take that. I'll take the win. And more packs. Alright, so I'm one and one. That game took entirely too long. He says, just need to get the fingerprints done, and you'll have your CCW, and possibly buy a gun. Oh, cool. Yeah, I, I, have to do the, I have to do the whole thing. I would have to go to the class and everything, the whole process. So. But yeah, luckily here in uh, Nevada, you can, you know, um, open carry. You have to get you, like your concealed license to actually conceal it. So, yeah, I was thinking about it, but want to practice more before I get it. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, I already went to. You already went to the class. Oh cool. So yeah, you're definitely ahead of me. You're ahead of the game. And yeah, I'd say that I would say definitely practice more. Go to the shooting ranges, and you know. Fire off some rounds and just practice. I think it costs though. I think it costs per like per bullet or something like that. Like you pay for the bullets. I did it. I did it for my birthday as a birthday present. Oh, okay. That's cool. Treat yourself. All right. So yeah, he's going down immediately. And actually, all of my cards are two drops. So let's go ahead and uh, rush this. Let's go ahead and rush this. I have such a low cost hand. No, it's not. Oh, no. Not if you bring your own bullets. It'll cost you 10. Oh, okay. So you just pay for like the time if you have your own bullets. Oh, that's cool. Okay. I didn't know that's how that worked. I thought you literally had to like buy bullets there. Otherwise, they just, you know. Yeah, this is insane how quick this this um my deck's going right now. I've already got three creatures. And he hasn't dropped anything. And he doesn't even have a... Okay, I was going to say. He doesn't have a weapon. Because his hero powers do two damage. That was smart. Smart, smart, smart. Um, I don't want to play that. Because I need the life seal for later. So, I'll just... Like I don't need the heal right now, so 
it went I went to a discount discount firearms to qualify oh okay my CCW coach already had the bullets and everything so all I had to do was pay at the firing range oh okay oh that's cool so they did it as kind of like oh here's a oh was it like a part of like a package or something is that why they were able to get you the bullets and stuff or they were just being cool and was like hey well we already have the stuff you know you just have to go down there I'll play this and we'll attack Ooh, excuse me so burpy this morning jeez it's like oh, I've been drinking this water and juice No, no, everyone basically uses his gun and his bullets. Oh, okay. So it was like he brought everybody from like his class and he just had all the equipment and everybody just used his stuff. That's actually pretty smart, actually. If that's the, you know, save people some money. I'm having a bad day. Aw, coffee. What's, what's wrong, coffee? Talk to us. How can we make your day better? If we can make your day better, let us know. You want to? You want to? You want to see my crazy daughter? I can show her real quick. If you want to see her, come here. Come here, baby. Say hi. Say hi to Coffee, and say hi to and say hi to Goddess. Hi, Coffee. Hi, Goddess. Say hi, everybody out there. Hi, everybody out there. Yeah. And BB Shine. That's what her Twitch name's gonna be. If nobody takes it, <laughs> I think I think uh, a double already made it. Yeah, this is my little my little baby baby. Here, let me play this round real quick. This is my little girl, and or me and a double kitty's daughter. I she can speak like the people. You can, oh, you can speak to the people. Oh, okay. I can speak like the people. Uh, who are you showing? You showing your naked doll? Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Who is that? Chelsea? No, she's not. That's not Chelsea? No, she has earrings. She, oh, yeah. she has. Oh, oh, okay. Look, here. Oh, she does. Okay. So you go back and play. Say bye, everybody. Bye, everybody. Yeah. Okay. Go play. <laughs> I'll get you one in a second, baby. So, yeah, there's my little, my little princess. <laughs> so beautiful. Yeah. My little twin. Oh, oh my God, this is gonna suck. Hold on, let me concentrate for a second real quick, and then I'll come back to you. Um, this, cause this car right here could kill me. So, I need, ah oh, man, okay, so. I don't, I can't have him bring this back. So I need to, I'll risk, I'll risk it. And then. Kill that. All right. Draw a card here. Okay. And play this. I don't have a weapon, so it doesn't have charge. And in. Okay. All right. <laughs> so, uh, kids running around espresso. They're all hyper. Legit started to cry because I hate my face mushrooms. Coffee. Now, I get it. I guess it's, it's different when you're, uh, like, I guess, born male versus, you know, uh, transitioning to male. Um, like, I already have a ton of testosterone, so I don't see myself as, you know, like, ugly or, you know, or attractive or anything. You know what I mean? I just kind of say, I'm me. You know what I mean? Um, so I don't feel that, like, the same as um, women do, I guess you could say, because, like, all the women that I know with that stream, they all have that same kind of anxiety. They're always like, oh, my God, you know, I look terrible, this and that and the other thing. And I'm always just like, no, you're beautiful. Like, you look, you look fine. You know what I mean? Obviously, you see yourself that way. But to be perfectly honest, I thought you looked fine. Like, I didn't, you know, I didn't see any issues with it, you know. So, you know, it's, it's it's how certain people perceive themselves. 
Um, and I can tell you as a friend that you look fine. <laughs> I didn't see anything wrong with it. Like there wasn't like like hairs out of place or anything, or you know, like you look you look you look fine. You know what I mean? So, and if you don't believe me, you can you know ask ask whoever else was on the stream. Uh, one sec, I'm gonna read chat in a second. Let me do this real quick. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Okay, I need have to. I need that to think about it. I need that to think about it. And then I'll just attack him directly. And I'll sh nah, actually I'll kill him. I don't want to take five. There we go. That puts me in a good position, but I'm also very low in cost. All right, so back to what I was saying. Um, she looks a lot like her mother. <laughs> well, now she does, yeah. When she was born, she looked just like me. You know what I mean? Like, if you, uh, anyone who's, like, my Facebook friends, they know. They've seen pictures of her when she was, like, younger. She is, like, my twin when she was young. Oh, she's precious. I think that helps a lot. Oh, I'm glad I could try to help a little bit, coffee. Oh, why do videos say expiring? Um, I think, I don't know. I, I know that they, for some reason, uh, videos do go away eventually. And that's why I'm trying to find, like, an editor so I can edit my videos and just put them on YouTube. That way, when they disappear, they're just, um, I don't know why, why it does it, Coffee. I don't know why they, oh, uh, whoops. I don't know why they, why it does that, to be honest. Yeah, I don't know why the, the videos disappear like that. It's weird, to be honest. It's pretty weird. But, oh, uh, what was I doing? Oh, yeah. Precious, a lot, turn. And apologize to Coffee if you have your pronouns wrong. Uh, no, I asked, I asked him about what, uh, what he preferred and what he identified as, like, way before, um, like, way back. <laughs> so, if I'm wrong, yeah, let me know, Coffee. But I'm pretty sure I asked about that. Um, because they expire after a certain amount of time. I thought so. I think, I think so, too. Like, after months or so of sitting there, then they just, like, go away. So, and you always, you can always download them. To your computer okay actually yeah that might be a good idea I might do that here, let me break this weapon break this weapon up here yeah you're not about to hit me for five sorry dude that's not happening and then you do that it should kill both of them dirty tricks after your opponent plays two a spell draw two cards okay so he gets two cards for that that's fine I don't care and then I'll use this to draw three cards Attack him directly. And then, there we go. Good program or anything. They, he, him. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Yeah, I asked him about that. I try to be, you know, socially acceptable to everything. So. So, kill him. I don't really need to get too aggressive. So I can just drop this. Like, I was going to do the 10 drop, but I'll just drop him. Thank you for asking. Yeah, that's good if you got us. I mean, honestly, you know, that's that should be, like, one of the first things everybody asks. Just because of how... You know, today's day and ages, you know, people identify as different things, so you should, that's probably one of the first things you should always ask. Actually, I noticed that too on a lot of people's discords, they have like a section and it just says pronouns. Um, and at first I was like, what's that? You know, <laughs> like, what's that all about? I don't, like, what do you mean pro, you know, um, and then it like, it clicked when I like read into it a little bit more. I was like, oh, I see what you're doing. Okay. 
that actually makes sense to have something like that, you know. Um, so yeah, I should I should probably have something like that on my Discord too, to be honest. Uh, I don't know if I want to make the creature or just give him a plus one. I think I can just give her a plus one now. There we go. All right, that works. That works. That's what I wanted. Then we can play that. And now I can plus one everyone. See? Smart plays. Smart plays. That's how you do that. And then... A little bit of that. A little bit of that. I don't care if he gets his health. I just want, his, I just want him dead. It's like, I don't care. Get your health back. It's fine. It sure does. Yeah. Yeah, I think I need to add that to uh, my Discord. It's like a... You know... Uh, like a pronoun section, I guess. Cause yeah, I'm, I think I think I'm on like ten to like fifteen different discords, and I want to say half of them have that. So <sighs> super late to get that right now. Uh, let's just be. I mean, it's over already. I'm basically just playing it to play it. Cause I mean. He's dead. Alright, two wins. Yeah, usually I get around somewhere around like the five wins before I just like lose out. I've never I think the most I've ever gotten is five. Five wins in arena. So I think twelve is the max you can get. Twelve wins. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's as bad with the drop in the frames. It, hadn't, it hasn't done it since... It's been about 10, 20 minutes, or 15 minutes since they've dropped any frames. So, Seems like it's getting better. Do you want a banana, baby? Okay, gotta get your banana. Hold on. Don't jinx yourself. I know. <laughs> It just happens. Like, I'll get... Like, I won't even be thinking about it or, like, you know, I'll just literally get to, like, five or six, like, five or four wins and I'll be sitting there, like, anxiety, like, I just want to get one more win. I just want to get one more win. And then something just happens. Like, just terrible draw or whatever. Um, actually, I could play this on turn one right now. You don't pick the I'm sorry, not that... Not that chatty. I'm on my phone with friend who's crying. Oh, no, you're good. You're all good. You're all good. Life happens. We all have things. We all have things. You got hurt. Yeah, my child, a banana. A banana. A banana. A banana. <laughs> a banana. won't survive though I wanted to survive so I can get the all right I'll take the I'll take the damage so I can keep my creature I'll take the damage it's fine it's fine yeah all to the good all to the good uh, I'll make sure that uh moon bot's working here okay there it is just making sure that moon bot was still working there doing his thing it was kind of quiet This is the one that heals? Yeah, I have to kill that. Crap. I wanted something to do... Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, this is it. We'll do that. Yes. This gets me two creatures. Okay, cool. Um, Yeah, let's do that. Count your blessings, mate. And then plus one to this guy. Kill him. And uh, all right. Interesting. All right. Like 
are you gonna do, bro? What are you gonna do? Like, man, I'm getting hungry. We ended up uh, barbecuing for my daughter's birthday, so we still have like barbecue and stuff left over, and tons of food. It's like been eating hamburgers for like the last couple days. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it kind of sucks. Um, for those who know me, you know I usually have, like, get-togethers, like, quite often. But, you know, with all this going on, everybody's kind of like, ah. And, like, it's weird because I have, like, I have so, like some of my friends will be like, hey, let's get together and this and that and the other thing. And then they'll be like, oh, did you guys get tested? And it's just like, really? Like, I mean, yeah, we did, but still, like. That's not how you invite people. <laughs> no, you're right. Better safe than sorry. But that's like, it's 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 a weird thing to say if you're trying to invite people up. Like, if you're like super afraid of, you know, everyone uh, that's coming to your event that may or may not have it. Um, I don't know. I guess there's better ways to to go about it. Is what I'm saying. You know what I mean? Like. You could make it like kind of like a joke in a way and be like, oh, jokey, jokey, we're doing like, you know, a, you know, pandemic party or something. And, you know, make sure that everybody's wearing masks and everybody, you know, has been tested kind of a thing. And it could be more like, oh, this is like, you know, the event itself. You see what I'm saying? So it doesn't seem like you're just going, well, I want to have people over, but I want to make sure that everybody's tested. You know what I mean? Which is fine. And that's 100%. Correct. You do want to make sure that everybody is safe because you want to make sure that your family is safe and that everybody that's coming over is not going to, you know, contract anything. But there's ways to ask people, I guess, like I said. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, there's a nicer way to ask. There's a more professional way to ask. Is I guess that's the point I'm trying to make. No, no, better safe than sorry. When it comes to doing a lot of get-togethers stay and staying at home. But not the whole, by the way, did you guys get tested already? Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, it kind of came out like, oh, by the way. You know what I mean? Instead of, um, you know, this is what I would want people to do if they were coming over. Kind of thing. You know, so there's, like, like, I'm basically saying there's just a different way to do it than to just say it like that. Because it just makes people feel, uh, a, like, defensive, I guess you could say. When you just kind of go, hey, did you get tested? You better go get tested. You, come out. you know what I mean? Like, they're going to do that either way because they want to be safe. At least the people that you deal with. You know what I mean? Otherwise, you wouldn't be dealing with them because... <laughs> so... Alright, here we go. This is what I was waiting on. So I could play this. Basically kill this guy, weaken him, weaken this enough to where I can use this. So... That's kind of the goal here. But me, how I've been doing it, like, if people come over, it's very small numbers. Like, I had two people come over, um, like, the other day when I was, like, moving um, Emerald's room around. And then when her birthday, only, like, two people came by. So, you know what I mean? Like, it wasn't even... So we have very like very very limited numbers whenever I have anybody come over nowadays. So and like my friend Jeff stopped by and we let we literally just like sat in the garage. He didn't even come in the house. So like But me personally I miss it cuz I'm always I was always having like weekly get-togethers D and D like every Friday. Um, anytime there was events coming up, I would barbecue, birthdays, all that kind of stuff. So, like me personally, I miss it. I am going to die. He is about to kill me. So let me kill that. He's not playing any weapons, so it's make it's it's really annoying. 
I can get three armor. That's not enough. If I drop him, what is this? Six, seven, eight. Shoot. Um, Death is so profitable. Okay. I'm probably going to die, but that was the only real play I could do. Um, I haven't got tested yet, so it's cool. People don't want me. Oh, it's cool if people don't want me over. I'll stay away. <laughs> Tell me two or three people other than my house are sick. Yeah, I mean, um, a lot of times nowadays when you go to work or if you go to um, a job or if you go to like a casino or a place like that, they're just going to test you anyway. So it's pretty easy to get tested nowadays. And it's when, it, when it comes to, like, the temperature thing, because they'll just do, like, the temperature thing and that kind of stuff. But to physically go to, like, the hospital to go get the actual test, uh, the only person that did it in our household, well, we all did it after we quarantined, just to be sure. And then when our mom went back to work, literally, like, a couple of weeks ago, she got tested again. Um, and negative, you know what I mean? So and we've all been literally here around each other the whole time, so... I'm gonna go big, even though I'm pretty much dead because I don't have any taunts. I mean, I could have did that, I still would be dead because he can just take that off with one damage. So I'm pretty much dead. I, there's, there's really nothing I could do unless I had a taunt, which I don't. So yeah, yeah, there was nothing I could do. This game's pretty much over. Go ahead, kill me. My work doesn't hasn't done it yet, surprisingly. Oh yeah, the temperature thing always. Yeah. So I like the actual test. You can ask me to do it to take it. You can just go to the hospital. They do it outside now. Especially here in Nevada. You just go down there and tell them you want to, or you can call, set up an appointment, and you basically go there and they do it outside. You don't even go into the hospital. They just like, and they can even do it in your car, I believe, too. They can literally just test you in your car. So. If you really, really want to do it. But, I mean, if you're not showing any, like, symptoms or anything, then, I mean, it's not that big of a deal, to be honest. Unless you're, like, deadly afraid of it and you just want to be sure, then by all means. All right, another loss. So, one more loss and I, I will be out of the arena with my, what, two wins? So, I'm, like, two and two right now. Two and two. I bet because of your job because of what you do you're just like always there um this is not a terrible hand to start off with actually I want a one drop I want that taunt I want this I don't need this I can I can live without that yeah it's better I can drop oh that's better I can drop that now on my my on my first turn or I can wait and drop this on turn two. And, uh, uh, nah. might as well. Let's just, let's just get in there. Let's just get in there. But yeah, it's like, speaking of doctors and whatnot, my, I just got a call from my daughter's doctor. She has to go get her immunity shots on I think Tuesday Monday or Tuesday is your appointment so the shots that you get for school basically so you can get them in school yeah you're gonna get you're gonna get your, your school shots so that should be fun yeah exactly what I was thinking guys <laughs> I was like that's gonna be fun I don't know, she's pretty good with shots, though. Like, the last time, she didn't even really cry. She just kind of looked at it, like, what are you doing? Yeah. I was pretty good at distracting her, too, so. Jeez. 
So, yeah, let's do that. I have trained for days. I have trained for days. Get him. Get him. All right, now that you're at three, Get him. He, he would kill you. So, yeah. Uh, she'll be fine. She's actually excited about it. She was like, yeah, I want to go. So, because, you know, she'll get her little lollipop and her stickers and stuff like that. So, and there's other kids there. So, she's very, uh, she's a social child. She's very much like her daddy when it comes to that. So, she sees other kids and she's just like, friend! And, like, you don't even know them. <laughs> Like, kids will be, like, shying away from her, and she'll be like, No, you're my friend. Come here. Jack him. <laughs> uh. Jack him. Kill that guy. Easy. And we'll save that shield bash, because we need that. So, Friday, I'm supposed to, supposed to be my last day of work, but I wanted to stay for a couple more weeks. All and they the said yes, of because of money. Oh, sweet. Cause that's right, you're like privately contracted, right? To do uh, work, to like do like uh, tech work, basically, like tech support and uh, things like that. Ready for action. Correct. Can you edit videos? Guys. Cause I mean, if you could do that, you you're probably gonna have like six or seven people that I know that would would need that service. Cause like just about everybody that um like recently made affiliate in like my circle of friends, they all need people to like edit videos, except for uh, scared. I think she's doing her own, and she only does them as like clips though. She has like like minute clips or five minute clips and stuff like that all on her YouTube. So I could do one damage because I only have one armor. Oh, here we go. Let's silence him so that he doesn't get... What was he going to get? Another creature, yeah. So none of that. Um, then... Actually, let's get that creature. We need that big bulky creature. That big bulky creature. Says a lot. No, that's funny, but no, I haven't tried it. I think when I did try, it's just not. It's just not working. Yeah, it's weird, cause like, like I can, so like I can clip stuff and I can get like, you know, like I can edit the video to where I can like you know shrink it or you know whatever. But I don't know how to like go in and literally like cut pieces out. You know what I mean? Like cut sections out and then like put them together. So that's like that part of the editing I don't know how to do. So, but like, like edging stuff, like cutting off the beginning of it or cutting off the end of it or, you know, things like that. I could do that, but that's not editing. You know what I mean? That's literally just highlighting, basically. Man, he's got so much freaking health. Oh. Forgot I had one of these. I forgot I had one of those. I want to kill him because he's the taunt, even though he's more dangerous. But he's a taunt, and I have two of these, so. Go ahead and kill them both. Uh, he uses weapons, so I'm going to save that. And now he kind of has to take one of his creatures and run him into mine, so. I got frustrated, or getting, or get frustrated. I mean, when I, I mean, I can try. I'd say try on your own videos first and see how it works, you know what I mean? And see if you like it and if you can get it. I mean, if you have the time, you know what I mean? Like, I was just asking to see if you already had the knowledge, you know? Like, I wouldn't I wouldn't want you to put yourself in a situation where, you know, you would get frustrated and doing something that, you know, you might not necessarily even want to do it, you know what I mean? So, yeah, I was just curious if you just knew how, just had the know-how, that's all. 
Uh, so he will survive this. I'll get my lackey. Give me my lackey. Or I can get something rushed. What are you screaming about? Why are you screaming? Anyone? Stop screaming. That works, actually. That works out. Yeah. I'll take it. I know how it was last night. Oh, you know how it was last night when I was playing Beat Sabers on expert mode? Yeah. Yeah, that's how it probably... <laughs> the video when you edit. <laughs> just so much random stuff just flying at you and then like all this like <laughs> digital data just flying around you. <laughs> yeah, that was insane. Like I was half asleep and then uh, when you got off, Adobo got on, so then I had to like moderate for her. So I was like half asleep during that too. But as soon as that, as soon as I seen that happen with your uh, on your gameplay, and you're like, oh crap, oh crap, what is this? Why am I doing this? Oh my god, I can't believe it. And I was just like, what is going on? And I like turned my, I think you were on my phone. So I like looked at it, and I was like, why is she freaking out? And then I was just like, oh, oh. <laughs> like, I see. Yeah. Jesus. I can get this thing so freaking strong. I don't have enough armor to kill these things. Uh, oh, actually, I could do this. And rush this. Now I can attack. Kill one of them. There we go. Alright, that saves me for a bit. <laughs> yeah, that was, that was that was intense when I was watching you. <laughs> I was like, oh my god. And see, the type of person I am, that's how I would have started the game. I literally, like, the first time I played Guitar Hero, I went to the hardest song and the hardest, like, I went on Expert in the hardest song, which I think was uh, Dragon Force, because I think it was on Guitar Hero 3. Um, so I think it was Dragon Force, was, like, the hardest song on there. And I tried to play that song on Expert. And I was just like, yeah, no, I'm not going to be able to do this. So then I went back down to, like, Beginner or Normal or whatever it was. Then I was just like, oh, this is easy. I was like, this is easy. <laughs> and that's literally how I like got pretty good at like Guitar Hero, to be honest. Because I just tried the hardest possible mode first. And there, after that, it was like, oh, this is easy. All right. Please attack. Did he steal this? How the frick did he get that? Hold on. Let me go back and look at something real quick. Deal three damage to friendly. Oh, yeah. Get the fuck out of here. He stole it. Bastards. Oh, yeah, and you can do, like, there is, I forgot about that. Um, you can, like, talk to people. Yeah, like little things you can say to the other people. And they all have something different they say. Yeah, he keeps taking, taking my creatures. Oh, he's got Priest as a second power. Forgot about... Son of a... 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 Alright. This is gonna be a problem. I think I'm dead, to be honest. Yeah. I can't do nothing with that, Jack. Yeah, I see that, dude. Calm down. Jesus. Yeah, calm, calm your yourself. Calm yourself. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty much dead. I swear it's like fat. She had an awful breakup. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Sorry. Oh, I know how that feels too. My, uh, my first wife, me and her had a very, very, very bad breakup. So, I completely understand that. 
until I get more views and people, I won't do expert mode again for a while. <laughs> yeah, I don't blame you. It's okay. I had to talk her down. I get it. You're you're a good friend. I'm sure she's happy to have someone there to help her and talk to her and, you know, help her get over the difficulties of breakups. It's happened a lot. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> so I went two and three. It wasn't a very good deck, to be honest. Like, I kind of picked a deck to just kind of play. Usually I would have went more, like, tech cards and more strategy cards. So... But yes, yeah, that's, uh, that's Arena, for those who got to see that. Any of the new game modes, cool. Um, now I'll show you guys Tavern Brawl. I'll show you guys this. Yeah, so, ta so Tavern Brawl changes every week or two. So they'll have this Tavern Brawl, it'll have a certain, like, as you can see, it says ends in four days. So after it's gone, then it'll be like maybe another four days or so, and then they'll add another Tavern Brawl, and then that will go for another week, and then, you know, three or four days go by, and then they'll add another Tavern Brawl. So that's how Tavern Brawl works. So it changes, you know, week to week. And you only have to win once to get the chest. So even though it says number of wins, you really only have to win one time to get the prize. Uh, people do this because they do keep track of how many wins and stuff that you've gotten overall. So that's what this is for. Um, so this is a new one. I haven't tried it. So it says Bass, Boss Battle Royale. Dress up your favorite character boss for a costume contest. And find who will be the winner. Okay. So a lot of times you don't get to pick the decks for these. They're already preset. So you're basically just picking the hero and you get that deck. Um, now I can tell you I have played I've played with him he's the demon uh, hunter he has a lot of like adding attacks to his damage kind of decks the white knight is the chess pieces they don't attack you directly you place them down and they attack adjacent or in front of them only so you can place them and then they basically attack directly in front you place one next to it it will attack the one that's adjacent or the one adjacent this way or the uh, um, player Never played with this deck. Looks like it's uh, Paladin, because you can tell by the symbols. That's Druid. That's Demon Hunter. Uh, that is uh, Druid 2, it looks like. Oh, that's not... That, I think that's Hunter. That's Druid, I believe. That's Rogue. Priest. Uh, Pali or Warrior. That is Hunter. That is Shaman. And that is Priest. So, I want to play... What do I want to play with here? I don't know. Let's try... Let's try Shaman. I like Shaman. It's okay. Um, yeah. <coughs> well, I hope she's feeling better, Coffee. I hope everything's working out. Um, you know, send us... Send her my regards. Yeah, it sucks. Relationships... It's rough this year. Especially for relationships. It's been really, really rough. A lot of people I know have uh, broken up or, uh, you know, divorced. Even myself. Like, we, you know, separated this year as well. So, it's been, it's been rough for people. This card is amazing. This nine drop is amazing. I don't want that just now. And I don't need two of those. Do you have a game? Do I have a game on PS4? Yeah, I got cheated on on Mother's Day. <sighs> Sucks. Yeah, it's been rough this year. Which game are you asking about? Do you game on PS4? Oh, you're asking if we game on PS4. Yeah, that's what I was playing. I play uh, Fall Guys. I'm playing on PS4. Yeah, I played Fall Guys on PS4. Um... I think that's the only game I'm playing on PS4 currently. I'll probably end up playing... Um, yeah, she plays mainly on PS4 too. She was playing VR on PS4. Evolve 1 minion. Dude, I have like nothing right now. Transfer friendly minion. Yeah, I can't do nothing. Yeah, we all play on PS4. 
I thought I sent you my, uh, my, uh, PlayStation Network, uh, name. My gamer tag. No, I don't have VR. Just got us. I would love to get VR, but it's, it's too expensive for me right at the moment. <laughs> so, I think the VR headset's like 100 and something, or something like that. Like, when I looked it up. It was just a little bit too expensive for me. And with me having a, you know, a, at the time when I looked into it, she was, you know, two, three years old. Uh, with her being that young, I didn't really want to have, like, I don't have a section in my house that's safe enough for me to do VR without, like, hitting something or hitting something. Like, I would have to get green screen or, like, I have to get something to, like, put myself in a corner to where I could, you know, uh, be in an area to where I can feel my edges so that way I'm not just like swinging all over the place or walking all over the place and like walking over my chairs and walking over my couch and you know so I'd have to like set it up in a way that I could do it um, this one's good I draw some cards and he's just trying to like boost his stuff so I got something for that I'm gonna kind of let him do that a little bit so I can wipe out his board so I'm gonna kind of let him I'm gonna kind of let him build up his small army and then I'm going to wipe out his board. Yeah, because that's what he looks like he's doing. <laughs> I'm jealous. I just got it this year. Yeah, I've been looking into it for a couple of years because I want an emerald. What did I tell you about that? Put that back. Um... Yeah, I want to get it because there's a bunch of games on VR that I want to play. Draw two cards. Oh, man, if I do that, I won't be able to play nothing. So, Overload, you guys probably didn't see that, but Overload blocks my crystals. So, if I use this, it does Overload 2, which means it will block two more crystals. My next turn, I can't use those. So, I would only have one mana to use if I use a card like that. So... I am not going to do that. I'm just gonna pass. I'm just gonna pass. I'm freezing. What the? <coughs> Are you anemic? Coffee? Because if that if that's the case, then that's probably what it is. Or you need uh, what is it? Is it vitamin E? When you? Yeah, you you are. Figured. I think you need vi Is it vitamin E? I'm not, because vitamin E, I think it's this iron. Oh, you need more iron? Yeah. Um, I think you also could get vitamin E, like if you stand out in the sun. Because my daughter was born with jaundice. And they basically say she was lacking, I think it was vitamin E. Basically, I had to hold her out in the sun for like 15 minutes a day kind of thing. Um, when she was like, you know, six months. Up until she was about six months. It's iron. So, F, E, oh, okay. Vitamin D. Oh, vitamin D. Okay, okay. Oh, you can just drink milk. The sun is, for sun, it's vitamin D. Yeah, oh, vitamin D, okay. Okay. But yeah, that's what I ended up doing. I don't have anything I can play right now. This is so, okay, I'll play this. Just because he's a big, beefy dragon. because he's a big, 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 beefy dragon. And I'm getting wrecked right now. I thought I had something to kill that. Like, I could have played... If that had gave me three threes, that would have been one, two, three. Yeah, I could take those guys out. All right, I'll have, to, I'll have to do that next turn. Yeah, I know because vitamin D was one, of, one out of a hundred of my iron. And I was point... Six out of a hundred two years ago. Oh, okay. Fun stuff, yeah. Oh, I know I don't actually keep track of that. I should probably do that, huh? I don't keep track of like my iron and like vitamin like levels. But I know I like I know when I have an iron deficiency because I crave steak. Like those days where I'm like craving meat, that's when I know, you know, my iron's low. All 
Alright. This is insane how... Please give me a lightning. Ah, that is not what I needed. I needed a freaking lightning. So I could wipe them all out. So now, I'm kind of stuck here. Alright, well, you can... They're supposed to have Rush! Do they not have Rush? Oh, they don't. Crap. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm just gonna... Actually, I don't even... I'm not even gonna waste my time here. I was like, I'm not even gonna waste my time. I'm already dead. Just gonna quit out. You used to crave ice? Really? And like, ice to like chew on? Would, would I just be craving water, technically, though? Like, technically? I'll try again. I'm gonna try a different deck. I didn't really like that Shaman deck. Let's try the Hunter. I often low potassium for some reason. Um, you can get that for bananas, right? I think. Bananas and like uh, plantains and stuff. Isn't that potassium? If I'm saying that right. Potassium, right? Yeah, I like to eat ice cubes from Starbucks VT Cup all the time. <laughs> Why does it have to be from Starbucks Fenty Cups? Is it because of what they use to make their ice? Are they using, like, like legit water instead of just, like, whatever crap that they have coming out of the faucets that makes, like, an ice machine? I was going to keep both of them because they're both taunts, and they're it's, it's still pretty good. And this card's pretty good, too. Oh, that's fun. What does this do? Trigger all death rattle effects. Oh, that's so good! Oh, that's so good. That means I just draw with this. Oh, that's so good. Let me just draw. That's so good. Yeah, you see that too, don't you? He hovered over my power and was like, ah, what do yours do? Give a reborn. And it cannot be targeted by hero powers or spells. Oh, that's pretty good too. Jesus. Oh, oh, I don't know if you all saw my venti, my vent post. I was disguised as an evil disease, and it doesn't have a, and I did a vent art. No, I did, I think I did actually, I think I was on there, but I was lurking, uh, coffee. So I seen it, but I don't think I was like inherently paying complete attention to it so you probably have to explain a little bit more i know you did say you had a yeah something going on with your octopus but yeah that sucks dude um for me oh hold on i'm about to like pass my turn up here reading uh, let's do that he's gonna kill him because he doesn't want to keep he doesn't want me to keep drawing um for me it was different water it's different than ice cube. Well, yeah, I know that. And yes, I know it's frozen water, but my body doesn't want it. It's, you know, different ice cube shapes, taste, and uh, different tastes, and you like how it tastes. Yeah, it's probably because the water they're using, um, goddess. Because a lot of places, like, so, like, when I worked at, like, mini marts and places like that, where they have, like, where they make their own ice, you know, gas stations, mini marts. You know those places where you can buy ice and it's in like a little machine? They have a machine in the back that makes it. And it's basically just hooked up to a hose. And whenever the machine gets low, it refills it. So that's why if you like walk into a store and you hear like ice dropping randomly, um, the machine in the back is making the ice. But again, it's usually just hooked up to like a faucet. So the ice that you buy from gas stations... Uh, convenience stores, uh, usually mostly like grocery stores and things like that, or it's just basically faucet tap water that they're using. So that's why people are always like, "Oh, ice tastes nasty," or you know, the you know, it, uh, they want less ice in it because of you know certain things. Or you'll see like dirt in your ice. Like, have you ever been to a restaurant and gotten ice and then like the ice is dirty? That's why, because they literally it's literally coming from. Um, a machine that's in the back that's just like a big cooler and it's hooked up to a faucet 
and it freezes the water on top of it, and then when the thing gets low, it just drops the ice into the machine. So that's how it works. So most of the time when we're getting ice, it's basically dirty. It's just like tap water. So so Starbucks is probably using like filtered water or something like that to make their ice, and that's why it tastes that's why it tastes so bad. Tastes so good, I should say. Cause like when I do like my ice cubes, we use filtered water. Filtered water, like we filter our water and we put it in a um, in a thing, and I use that to make like my ice. So, or I'll even go as far as take like a bottle of water, crack it, and pour that into the ice tray, and then that's my my ice. So, oh, let me end my turn here. <laughs> right. It in interferes with my vision yeah yeah okay yeah okay so it was the same thing you're talking about Carl. yeah um yeah that's is so there's no cure but you can't get like lasik like if you got lasik would that help at all like would you still have to wear glasses would like would that like relieve it at all a little bit maybe did you look into that it had caffeine in it Ice cream has caffeine in. Oh, because you're drinking. Yeah, I got you. Okay, because you're drinking it after the coffee. So it's the it's the caffeine part of it that adds to um, the taste. Uh, let's take. I'm gonna take this one because it, it will fill up literally all of my dragon. And then I'll do this again. So I draw a card from that. Get two creatures from that. This hero power is really good. Like that's it's a really good hero power to have. He's getting his stuff, too. Because it does everybody. Yeah, I get another one. That's fine. Uh, let's do that. And attack you directly. And in. Yeah, we're just going to have a ton of cards because of our hero powers. It's okay. Oh. I wear grasses, and I cannot... I wear glasses. I cannot really need. Oh, I can't really. Oh, you can't really. Leave me far seen. And then need surgery just because of how bad my vision is. There's nothing that could help. That could really help, I think. They're trying out medical eye drops. Oh, you were thinking about trying out medical eye drops. Okay. And basically, you see TV static in front of everything that you look at. Oh, no. I may not can't. Oh no! I didn't know that. I didn't know it was that bad. Oh my gosh! I'm sorry. Yeah, it's weird because I'm like I'm like one of my only friends. Like if if you like all of, all of my friends, they literally all wear glasses. <laughs> like I'm the only one out of like even even if I'm as I'm thinking. I think the only person out of all my friends that don't wear glasses is me. Yeah, don't be scared. Like even um, people who usually didn't wear glasses, I don't want to kill them. Now they wear glasses. Like uh, Scared's husband doesn't wear glasses, but now he does. Well, he didn't need them, but now he does. So he also wears glasses now. Their nephew wears glasses. She wears glasses. A double kitty wears glasses. Um, my bro, my best friend wears glasses. My best friend that I consider my brother wears glasses. His wife wears glasses. <laughs> Their son wears glasses. Like <laughs> it's pretty crazy how many people that I like that are in my friends, like my circle of friends and associates and everything that wear glasses, and I'm the only one. So, uh, what's this? Oh, hmm. I mean, opponent's turn. Does I don't think that works on my. T that doesn't work on my turn. Yeah, it works on his turn. Okay. Oh, it's a stealth. He's a stealthy. He's a stealthy. If you're holding a dragon, I am not holding a dragon. I am not holding a dragon. 
But, alright, so I'm just going to hit him in the face. Wait, actually, I'm going to do a little bit of damage there. And we'll play him. This is if I'm, if I'm reading glasses, but I don't need them all the time. Yeah, I, I remember that about um, you guys. Like, yeah, you usually don't wear glasses, but when you need to read, yeah, you wear glasses. But that's still, like, considered wearing glasses to me. Because, like, I don't need them for reading or for anything. So, I don't wear them ever. Like, I don't have a pair of glasses unless they're sunglasses. <laughs> so, um, I had some contacts that I used to use for cosplay. But I didn't need them for, like, any kind of, like, vision purposes. Like, I had some shining gun, sh shining gun uh, contacts when I did my Itachi and, um, like, Naruto cosplays. And I had some whiteout ones that literally just white your eyes out completely that I was going to use for, um, I forgot the cosplay I was going to use it for, but I ended up getting really, really badly irritated by them, and I couldn't wear them. Like, they would hurt my eyes to wear them. It was really, really bad. So, probably had something to do with them, the fact that I got them from, like, China. Like, yeah, I don't care about that. You can do that. I need that. That's what I want. Yeah. I was like, that's what I wanted. I wanted my creatures. And then now... Attack you. The pain. Yo, another Naruto cosplayer. Yeah, I cosplayed for... Uh, I mean... I don't know if you guys can see it, but... I have the sealed curse mark on my neck from Naruto, so, yeah, like, all my tattoos are anime-based, it's fairy tale, so, um, but yeah, I did, uh, from Naruto, I did Itachi, um, I usually do, I did Itachi, and I did Sasuke, when Sasuke was in the Ikatsuki, basically, um, so I basically did, like, two Ikatsuki, um, Naruto cosplays, and I've done some Pokemon ones. I've done uh, Roni Kenshin's cosplays. Um, I'm trying to think. I've done, I've done quite a few. Not a whole lot, but I've done a few. So I lost again. All right, I'm going to try one more time on this one. <laughs> that was a really good deck. It's just I went up against a deck that was super similar. Like, these two are very similar, and that was the problem. But I, I'm gonna try. Let's try Doctor Boom. This is probably a bunch of like. No, I don't want to try Doctor Boom. I'm gonna go back to this one. I actually like this. I think it will work if I get a better hand. Yeah. But yeah, we used to cosplay all the time. I used to when you know events were happening. Pretty much every Vegas and some of the California ones. Uh, conventions whenever they have anything in vegas i pretty much either uh organize it organize events in it as in i do like the tcg or i'll do like the pokemon contests um you know things like that or i'm literally like the person that's literally like event coordinating an entire event um when it comes to conventions and i've been pretty much doing that since man i want to say 2012 so usually I go to events for free. Like I don't, I haven't paid to go into a convention in, oof. I haven't played to go to a convention since like 2013. <laughs> like every convention I've been to, I pretty much get in for free because I'm staff. Not only do I get in for free, I usually get extra tickets and I get extra people in. So I usually have like a group that comes with me and they're like my staff. Actually Goddess has uh came with me once before as one of my uh what was the shirts called that I had for you guys? Lackey? I think it was Lackey one and Lackey Two. When you and uh Shadow Shadow Wolf. <laughs> Is it, I used to do Itachi. Yeah. A lot of people did. That's why I kind of stopped doing it. Um, because I would go, 
and it will literally be like six of us as Itachi, and you'll have like one Madara, or I should say Toby, you know, and you'll have like one Obito, you know, so it's like, it, we would go around looking for the other people, so that way we could take like a group picture of like all the Itachi, and we'd always be missing somebody, but we'd have like five Itachis. <laughs> So yeah, I'm gonna play smart about it this time. The, f the last time I just wanted to see how many I could just like, how many death rattle abilities I could just like pop off. But now I'm actually like, okay, I'm gonna kill you. I'm actually gonna try to win. What does this one do? Everyone gets plus attack. I'm gonna save that. I'm gonna save that ability. So he's gonna try to run my guys down, so I'm gonna let him try to run my creatures down while I keep attacking him. That's the strat for this for this game right now. But yeah, I actually enjoy cosplay. Um, that's why I have like a cosplay section there. I don't have a lot of pictures in there. I think I only have like four or five. But I have a ton of pictures on Facebook from my cosplay. I would have to go there and basically just like. Uh, copy a bunch of them and post them on the Discord so you guys can see it. Yeah, we're actually gearing up for our next like cosplay idea. We're gonna do, uh, like, I guess it'd be closer to like Renaissance cosplay, I guess, because we're gonna do like D and D characters. Um, crap. Not a town, but it is what it is. So, like, people are going to dress up like a rogue or a wizard or a barbarian or a knight or blah, blah, blah. Uh, so, that was the next cosplay idea that we were going to do. Because we were going to go to. There was a. Basically, kind of like a D&D convention that I got invited to. Um, and they actually wanted me to DM. And they basically wanted me to take up a section and, you know, like, teach people how to play D&D. &D. Um, so I was, they were going to set me up a booth, and I was able to, I was going to bring, I think I had enough room to bring, like, ten people. So we were, like, planning it, planning the cosplay and all that kind of stuff. And, you know, COVID happened, so... Yeah, luckily level up happened literally like the middle of March or like the beginning of March, right when Nevada was like, okay, we should probably shut down. So they got their convention off like a week before the shutdown. So they were like, they got lucky. <laughs> That's a mood. Yeah. Can you see that okay? Or is that like... Hold on, sorry. That's so weird. Okay, I thought my mic was getting hot, hot for a second, but it's my computer. I need to get another, I need to get a cooler for my laptop. Um, secret discover a dragon. Yeah, let's do that. If you're holding a dragon. Put all dragons in your hand in the field. Yeah, let's take that. Let's go ahead and activate that. Let's go. Big boy noise. I'm not even going to attack his creatures because he's going to need all of them to take out my 12 12. It says, oh, we should have a cosplay photo share channel in the clouds. I have one. It says cosplay. I don't think it. I don't think it says like cosplay in the in the clouds, but I think it just says cosplay. Um, I can change it to like cosplay in the clouds or something like that, you know. But I believe I do have one there on the Discord. If I don't, let me know, cause then I'll add it, cause I'm pretty sure I did.
Yeah, and I think um, you're a moderator on my Discord too, Coffee. So if there's something that's not there, and you you know, and you're like, hey, we should have that, and I'm like, yeah, go ahead. You can add it. You know what I mean? Like that's what the permissions for, you know. Yeah, I'm not, you know, I'm not super particular about, you know, stuff like that. So. Yes, baby. You know it's almost your nap time. I'm letting you stay up a little later. Because Daddy's playing. Oh, I probably should have did that. Oh, actually, that worked out. I thought, oh, I read that wrong. Yeah, okay, so I've had dragons in my hand. They would all came to the field. But I mean, do you see? Do you see how strong my deck is right now? Or how strong? Oh, I did not want to attack him. Crap. I will kill that, though. I will kill that. No, I want to attack him directly. Because he's pretty much dead. Look at how much damage I have on the field 24, 36. I have 36 damage right here. <laughs> like, it's over. You know what I mean? Like, now I'm just toying with him. By accident. Now I was trying to fix my chat box to see if uh, you guys can see that a little bit better. Is that, should I make it a little bit bigger? Yeah, I'll make it a little bigger. A little bigger so you guys can read it. You don't really need to see my crystals on that side, so that doesn't really matter. So. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I probably forgot. You can even put pictures there. Yeah, yeah, I got, yeah, that's what it's for. It's literally to, to share your uh, cosplay pictures and stuff. Because I like to see them. I like to see them. Let's do a little bit of that. Give us another uh, jade. There's a dragon. I get something for free. So good. So good. All right. Get you out the way, and you're dead. And that. Oh no! He's got one. I miscalculated. That's all good. I mean, he could possibly kill me. To be honest. Because you can do 10 damage with, like, magic. Not through Druid, though. Unless he has... He would have to have two star players. And he'd do five each. But he couldn't do them both, though. Because they cost six. So, he doesn't have a way... Oh, no, he could do that, um... No, even that doesn't do... It does five damage, he draws five cards. And he gets, five, like... Uh, a 5-5 five, five creature. The 10 drop card. So he doesn't have a card that could kill me. Mage does. Mage has a 10, like, a spell that just does 10 damage to you. And then Shaman could build up to 10 damage. With 10. Because he has a bunch of cards that can do like 3 and 2 and 3 and like, stuff like that. The Druid? No. That's the way he could have killed me right there. If he would have rush, if he had rush on that card, I'm, I would die. That literally been game. Good game, guy. GG. You want to just quit, or you want me to like smash you in the face? You, you want to take twelve to the face? So that's a win. We win in the cavern brawl. How long have I been playing? Oh, two hours. Jesus. I didn't realize I was playing so long. Alright. So we did the Cavern Brawl. We showed you Arena. We showed you Cavern Brawl. So you guys got to see those two different modes. Um, Battlegrounds, I'm probably not going to do right now. I might save that for another stream. That's long. That's like eight verse. That's eight people all in there. That's like an hour. It'll take like 45 minutes to an hour. Um... And then they have solo adventures, which is basically like the story. Story quests. There's a new story. 
So as you can see, there's like, let me close this. All right, I was trying to, yeah, there we go. So you can see each of these are like story. Like you have the practice where you can learn how to play. And then this is like each of the uh, stories that are there. And then like, yeah. So if you want to do like a single player mode, the newest one is this one. I haven't done it yet. The Book of Heroes. So let's take a look at it real quick. Maybe we'll do one game and see what it's like. So Jaina, Mage, and Rexar, the Hunter. Let's go with Proudmore. The daughter of the seas. Rise to be oh, so this is how she became. So this is how they become their heroes. Oh, this is cool. So this is a story on how each of them became this. This is her. Hmm. So this is her as a apprentice going to Dalaran to train under the Archmage. Huh. That's cool. Yeah, that card is legit. Basically, every time you play a spell, he gets a fireball card, which is a four drop, six damage card. But anytime you play any spell, he just gets a fireball card. So he just keeps getting fireballs, 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 fireballs in his hand. And then you're literally just going six damage, six damage, six damage, six damage. Six damage. So she's gonna have to prove herself here. That's a pretty good hand. I don't need icicle though. Yeah, you can also play with like the backgrounds on these games. That's one thing that people didn't know. You can play with stuff. Usually it does things. Sometimes you can break stuff. Yeah. Turn the fire off. Yeah, so you can do little stuff around the stage too. Um and she oh so she only has fire blast, right? Or I she has ice blast instead of fire blast. So when she started off she was an ice mage. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah, so Jana Proudmore. In, in uh, Warcraft, she's basically one of the uh, kind of like leaders of the rebellion or the leaders of the alliance. Um, yeah, she's like one of the leaders, I guess you could say. I guess you could consider that. She's pretty well known in Warcraft as you know the mage for the alliance. I mean, yeah, he's pretty good. I'll take that, thanks. Like you. It's almost nap time, baby. You ready to take a nap? All right, so... I mean, I'm not getting my... It's not going to damage me any much. His deck is so good. So basically what's happening, each one of these cards makes your spells cost one less. He has three of them out. So now, basically any card that he has that's three or less is zero. He just pays it for free. That's why he's playing so many cards. Look at that. Zero, zero, zero. He just keeps playing spells because they're all cost zero now. So good. He literally just sumped one of those and they made two copies of it. Such that's so good. Oh my god. Alright, well this can kill this can kill all of them. 
Give rush to. Give one of your other minions rush. Deal two damage. Ah, no, I don't need to do any of this because this. Once he attacks me, all his cards are dead. So I'm just gonna hit him for one. Cause that's what my trap does. Yeah, minion attacks. Yeah, see, and then two damage to all of them, or three damage to all of them. Goodbye. Ah, mine's higher, so he doesn't get his effect. That's what that does. Reveal, and then whoever has the highest cost. If he gets the highest cost, he gets his effect. If I get the highest cost, he doesn't. So, Alright, so let's play Counterspell. Dude, I know he's going to play a spell next turn. He's going to play a spell next turn. Um, let's kill... Let's kill him. Oh, yeah, duplicate. Rush, give a minion rush. I don't have any other minions out, so it's a waste. That would be a waste to play that. Nice! At the end of your turn, reduce the cost cost by one? He's lowering all the cost of his cards. That's literally his strat right now. This is horrible. I'm in so much trouble. At the end of your turn, draw until you have three cards. No, that's like, that's what you do when you have nothing. Other cards have rush. Okay. Oh, other rush cards have rush. So take him down. We'll take him down, and we're not gonna play that. We'll keep that. We will keep that. Oh, we yeah, probably forgot. Yeah. But yeah, I'm probably not gonna be on much, on much longer. I'm gonna do this round and probably call it um, I knew it was going to be kind of like a short stream so nothing too crazy today we got adobo coming on tonight more than likely so Ooh, let's drop that That'll take out almost all of his cards. Let's drop him down a little bit. We need that card to get weaker. last turn counter this if you played an elemental last turn okay I have a freaking elemental spell well, let's take him out we don't need that uh, let's just play that Ready for this. and we'll play that because it gives him rush go ahead and wipe him out Freezing me up. Freezing me up. Good. Seven damage. Is my spell damage there? Well, yeah, let's go ahead and take him out. We need that to not do that. This will freeze other people. And we'll take one of them out. Freaking mirror images. Is, whew, on my phone. My phone's gonna die. <laughs> Plug it up to the charger. That's what my phone's doing right now. Sitting on the charger. Yeah, I'm probably going to be on for like another 30 minutes, 
so no worries. Do a little bit of this story and then that'll probably be it. How you deal with that field? That's the problem. I don't have enough life. He just keeps attacking me. So now I have to literally kill all his creatures every single round, or I die. Or I die. So how can I do this? Trade. Trade. There we go. Trade. Alright, and I should get one card from him. Yep. Alright. I win. So, no card for you. Yeah. the board wipe I was looking for. So let's play that. Everybody be strong. Everybody be strong. Take you out. I'm at two and I think I'm about to win. I think I'm about to come back here. The comeback. The comeback. Change cost of your minions to get your deck to one. You don't have that many cards so it doesn't matter. And it is over. For the alliance. For the alliance. Hey, Miss Jaina, you have won me over. I could not imagine a better candidate for my apprentice. Really? Thank you. Well, I just beat you, so. <laughs> she better be a good candidate. I was like, you just got defeated by her, so. Yeah, she's a good candidate. I don't know how much they're gonna let me play this story for free, because a lot of these times you have to like buy. My advancement grew beyond my wildest dreams, but so did the pressure I faced. All right, let's try it out. I think this was gonna actually let me play all of them, but I'm not gonna play all of them. I think there's eight of them. I'll play until I die, basically. If I die, then I'll stop. That should be about 30 minutes or so. Oh, young she is. May I have a demonstration of your studies, Lady Falmor? Certainly, Highness. You want a demonstration? You asked for it. Oh, yes. Blizzard. Card's so good. Two damage to all enemies and freeze them. It's really good. We're all... There it is, not mine. She's definitely an ice mage to start off. Oh, all right. Thank you. What is Charlin thought? I'm afraid. What is Charlin thought? So we get rid of that. He says, "What a charming thought." To everything. Hello. What is Charlin thought? Yeah, that's the only thing he says. What is Charlin thought? What is Charlin thought? Why are you being so difficult? What is Charlin thought? Yeah, that's what he's, that's the only thing he's... I remember when you were accidentally setting books on fire. Let's not talk about that. Accidentally? I don't want to waste this three damage for this two creature. I could freeze and do the two to him. Eh. But I'm not. Because I can just blizzard him on turn six and get rid of all of them. So. I see you still favor ice spells. It is fire that calls to me. I'm just trying not to burn any more literature. <laughs> That's fair. You fight me, you get burned. 
So yeah, he's like pure fire and she's ice currently. Every cast a spell, add a fireball to your deck. It costs two more. Oh boy. He's gonna be hitting me with a lot of six damages here in a second. Alright, one more turn. One more turn. I was just, I'm literally just waiting to play Blizzard. Yeah. That's why I brought him down to two. I can bring him down to two. Well. gonna get two minions. Yep. And four minions. Oh, they bring out two. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. So we'll freeze everybody. And this can do destroy the shatter. Yeah, we don't need you to do any of that crap anymore. Um, we'll do counter spell because he's gonna try to cast a spell. I already know he is. So, yeah, because mana uh, for these creatures get damage when they when he casts a spell, they gain damage. So, yeah, that's why I needed to I needed to stop him from casting spells. Perfect. We're going to play another counter spell. Because he's definitely going to do that again. Or try to. Um, let's see. Draw a card. Improve by spell damage. So we're going to get rid of one of these guys. Freeze this guy. And we're going to kill him. We gotta play defensive right now because of. I knew he was gonna cast a spell. Nice. Okay. So now he's out of cards. So he's top decking. Heal six damage. I need to draw a card, so. Alright, uh, I'll take that. Draw a card. We're in trouble. Ugh. We're in trouble. Yes. So this makes me immune for one turn. This changes all my minions to one drops. We're okay. We're okay for another like two turns. Yeah, we're okay. We are okay. You ready for a nap? So I want to freeze this one. Yes, and then we'll shatter it, and we're dead because that's four damage. Oh no, we're not. I forgot. I forgot. I was ice block. I totally forgot how to ice block. So this makes me immune. Yeah, that gave me one turn. He 
used up everything he could, and it did not help him. Ronch doesn't draw like. Oh, he did. Crap. I would say, as long as he didn't draw a fireball. This way. I've heard such wonderful things about you. No! Alright, no worries. So, yeah, I think this is a good stopping point. Um, like I said, I didn't plan on doing like a full on stream today. I just kind of wanted to play a little bit of Hearthstone, so I figured I'd do it with you guys and let you guys see how the game is. So that is Hearthstone, as you guys can see. Um, the normal mode is um, basically building a deck from the cards that you have in your collection. Um, yeah, see, these are the only two decks I have that are legal right now. Yeah, all the rest of my decks aren't legal. So I have a Shaman deck and uh, my Hunter deck. I could probably make some decks. If I want to play, and I never play casual, I always play ranked. So, and I don't play wild. I always play standard. But yeah, that's how you would go there and you play other people online. So that's how that works for um, regular play. So yeah, that's Hearthstone, guys. Here's some packs. Guess I can show you guys what it looks like to open up a pack. So you just put it there, and it pops open. You click on them, and when you get something that's better than common, it tells you. So, like, that's rare, it said rare. And let's open up another one so you guys can see. I want to see if I can pop a legendary so you guys can see it. So, yeah, another rare. Just going to open up some packs, and then we'll stop. Golden Common. Rare. And another rare. It's the color there, it tells you. Open up some packy packs. Rare. rare. Alright, another rare. Like, might as well just open them all up right now. And then that's... And then we're in there. Rare. rare. Let's get a bunch of rares. A bunch of rares. Another rare. Not really getting anything good. Sad. Rare, rare. Two rares. One of these has got to be a freaking epic or something. There it is. Legendary. That's the, that's the highest thing you can get. Well, you can get golden legendary. That's the, like, the best card you can pull. I got a legendary. That's cool. Epic, okay. Void Drinker, yeah, that's pretty good. And last pack. Alright. So that'll do it for my packs. And that will do it for this. Um, you can see here, you can you know buy stuff if you want to buy stuff. You can buy uh, characters, packs, Tavern bra uh, passes, which I don't have enough money to buy. Solo adventures, some of them you have to actually buy, as you can see. Um, they'll give you like a tutorial for some of them, but some of them you actually have to buy. Um, yeah, so that's like the stuff that you can purchase. Packs, card backs, limited time offers, things like that. 
So yeah, that is Herbstone. And then there are quest logs, you know, the quests that you need to do, basically. And it tells you all my levels. So how many arena wins I've got. Uh, basically where I'm at is over overall wins, overall levels for each thing. You cap at 60. So you can see I got priests at 60, uh, shaman at 60, paladin at 60, hunter at 60, paladin at 60. So those are like the ones I play a lot. And then your, your quest. So that is that. Opening packs, your collection basically shows really your entire collection. Um, all the cards you pulled. You can um, basically. Yes, yeah, so these are like all the cards up here in the top here. Each class. Because there's cards that's based on just their class. So I've got a bunch of new cards from each of these. And this is neutral. Yeah. So these are cards you can use in anybody's deck. So any class can use these cards, basically. And then they go, you know, from all that good stuff. You know, the seven drops and higher and so on. So that's pretty much how you do that. And then you got your card backs here, which I have a lot because I've been playing this game a lot. And it actually tells you, um, like, where you got them from. Like what game you got, like or what uh, event you did, or whatnot to actually you know acquire them. So as you can see, I have a lot of card backs because I've been playing this game. You get one. You used to get one every month. Every month there was like a new card back that you would get, um, as long as you uh, hit a certain rank. So I've unlocked quite a bit. Not all of them, because there's a lot of them I don't have. Let me use this one. Yeah, see, it actually tells you, log it into your PC, basically, for that particular one. And then, like, this one, yeah, got it when I got ranked 20 back in April of 0 and 14. Yeah. So that's, that was, I think that was the second card back I ever got. So that's about the time where I actually started playing this game. That was, like, the, f I want to say that was the first card back I got, actually. Um, is that red one. I think so. I mean, I'm just looking here real quick. Uh, yeah, I think that was the first one that I've got. Yeah, because this is what you start with. You start with this one. Yeah, everyone gets that one. So, yeah. So, that is... And then this is, what, my friends list, I think? Oh, no, these are my heroes. So, you can have different versions of these because both of them are druid, so you can use her or him. Um, I think I have two priests. Yeah, both of them are priests, so you can use her or him. Both of them are rogues, so you can use her or him. Uh, I don't have the secondary ones for everybody, though, as you can see. There are extra characters for just about every class. And then they also have their higher versions. Oh, I can get her as a child? We can get her as a scholar? Oh, it's probably after I do the, uh, after I do those missions, I probably unlock her. Yeah, so these are like all the different characters you can get as well. So that is Hearthstone, guys. Thanks for stopping in to the stream. I appreciate you guys. Appreciate everybody that came in. And actually, let's see who's uh, who's on that we could raid. Who's on that we could raid? I'm going to have to grab my phone because I can't see it from my laptop. somebody a raid real quick nothing major and call it a day and more than likely we will be on later with oh, I guess we could raid our boy meta uh, metaphysics moon metaphysics see what he's up to I think he's playing. Is he? What is he playing? I don't know what he's playing. I think he's playing uh, Horizon, but we'll see. We will see. We will see. But again, thanks everybody. I appreciate everybody that came in today. 
that joined the stream and everyone who was observing of Hearthstone. We are going to raid now, and thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Have a good one.